Hello everybody. Uh I'm back. Final crackers here. Uh wait, you can You can click this. Then you click F one or no. No, it doesn't work. It clicks F four every time. Okay. So I'm back doing some more campaign. Uh I need to replay mission because I wasn't recording sound. I was only through like Ten seconds of it though. Okay. Crap. All right, I'm gonna resume. Sorry. Cause I can't figure right, out the ninja without getting inside his fucking head. Salazar, you grew up in Nicaragua during his rise to power. You know his legends I better than anyone. Tell me, why does he hate us so much? I got like 10 okay, seconds past this uh, cutscene. As a boy, he witnessed the country's rape and murder his people. In 1972, there was a colossal earthquake. His family lost everything. A year later, the only thing he ever loved, his sister Josefina, was crippled in a fire. Raul and his father started over, sold drugs for easy money. They became rich, powerful legends of Managua. The Menendez cartel was all but untouchable. So the CIA took a Raul's father in a U.S. sanctioned assassination. Right, so now Menendez fucking hated America and started running guns in Afghanistan for his own private army. CIA got wind of it, went on the hunt for him in Kabul. That was the photo Wood showed us in the vault, remember? See that handsome bastard? That's me. The only one's your father. After Nam. The numbers and all that? He was one dangerous son of a bitch. <laughs> Smoking's bad for you. You shouldn't do that, Mr. Woods. Come on, let's, let's do this. Big tall man. It's showtime, Mason! Wait, I'm wearing a turban. Sweet. I love wearing turbans. What'd you see, Woods? Alright, I got up to this part. Sand. So I think sand it's all more cut fucking scene. sand. Hudson's contacts on his way. I think he saw a bit of trust sand. The Chinese? We can't hear him. They've been supporting the Mujahideen, same as us. What's in these boxes? Give me no no we're not. They know if Russian was boxes. in Afghanistan, they'd be looking at China next. No one likes the Russians, huh? You know me. I don't like anyone. You're a bit sassy. You might want to get your head down. What? Whoa, okay. What's this? Take it easy, Sal. Deliver the weapons. Now, what about your end of the deal? I will take you to the leader of the Mujahideen. Okay. He can help you find Raul Menendez. Look at it. We have fresh horses. You will what? follow. Right? Oh, I don't have Let's do it. Where is this? No, I want to control my screen. Here we go. Mason, it's Hudson. Did you make contact with Jiao? We're on our way to the Mujahideen camp now. What the heck? Is that his freaking sword? Ah! What the hell are you gonna do with that? You never know. That is hardcore! Awesome! Okay. Sweet! I can ride a freaking horse. This is awesome. I'm sure I don't need to remind you that our presence here must remain 100% deniable. There will be serious consequences if Russia learns of our involvement in Afghanistan. This is freaking amazing, dude. I love this horse. Look at him. Look at his hair. Sway in the wind. Is he a bad guy? Did we kill him? No? Okay. Wait, why do they use the same freaking white truck with the turret in it in every Call of Duty game? Since like COD 4. Wait a second. We must hurry. We believe the Soviets are about to launch an attack on the camp. No, hold on. I saw a Mason, cave back kick here. It up here. Don't tell me what to do. I saw this cave. I want to go in it. Nope, can't go in it. Okay. Yeah. Damn it, Mason. Yeah. Can't that horse go any faster? Shit. We. This is so awesome. Horsey. Pizzazz! 
Man! What? Macroff. This way. Oh. I'm not gonna park you. Okay, I'm going really slow. What the heck? Oh, you're making bullets. Okay. There isn't a bullet there. What about you? You're inspecting the bullets. Now I see some 3D bullets, but you're not picking them up. Okay. Have fun with that. Uh, horse butt. You. What about you guys? What are you guys doing? You are. And your your gun is broke because your finger's going through it. That's really gross, dude. Get that checked out. Um, what about you? You're gonna freaking break your gun. I can't move. What? Okay, I guess you're just like checking it out and stuff. So let's keep on going. Okay. If a Russian attack is indeed imminent, you're gonna need all the help you can get. I've arranged for a couple of specialists to act in an advisory capacity. Here they are now. The aviator dude. Ramon, this is Woods. And Mason, my two best men. We need weapons, not soldiers. I'm pretty sure, like, that aviator dude's voice is, like, be good. really delayed just then. I'll have to check it in the recording. Okay, let's do this, guys. Just so we're clear, we hold off the Russian attack, you give us what you have on Menendez. Our base is here. Where? Any advance will come through one of the narrow passes leading into the valley. I know this. Our men defend these mountains. Our weapons will give them an edge. That's a bullshit plan. You're talking about the Russian army here. They come at you with brute force, which means strength in numbers and heavy armor. Are your men ready for that? I don't know, are they? They have no experience with the weaponry we brought. They don't seem to be wearing armor. They're just like... We do. We belong they could be in the front line. The okay. Yalla! Yalla! Barabirun! You have faith in your plans, America. Like a modern faves out. Let's rock it. Rock it, rock it, poku die. We must hurry! We cannot okay. allow them to I'm enter the valley! Now, horses. Up, Let's Let's go. go! Wait, where am I going? Oh, we're good. Guys. Guys, where are you? Guys. Where'd they go? Okay, screwed. I'm just running. I don't know where they went. I wasn't going by foot. I was on a freaking horse. What? <laughs> that did not work. Hey, I'm on the horsey. Okay, I guess I gotta go behind you guys.